dying. Help me. Hey guys, T-Max signing in. Hope you guys are having a great day. Now, today I'm bringing you another episode of the Most Overpowered Squad. Now, I'm currently not feeling too well, so excuse me if I end up coughing a lot or if I overall just sound really weird in this video. Anyway, you guys have been leaving your squads in the comment section. Once again, I've gone through them as usual with some pretty beastly squads in there, but I decided to go for the one I chose, especially because of the formation and the dude that suggested the team was this guy. So, thanks for your suggestion. As always, if you have your own suggestions, the squad you want me to use make sure to drop them down in the comment section i read through all the comments i look at all the squads so your squad could be next and this is the formation is gone with the 41212 formation the squad he used with this look pretty op which is the main reason i went for it and i actually played a few games with it and i'll tell you guys how that went on in a moment that loss of the goalkeeper this guy chose diego alves decent diving and reflexes stats on him pretty op goalkeeper if you ask me back for he went with rodriguez naldo miranda and abate pretty strong strong looking back for especially with the pace in Abate strength you get within Miranda and Naldo and let's not forget the 84 defending as well as 82 passing on Rodriguez CDM who went with Guarin who has the stats to be a CDM and plays well in that position as well left mid he went with Sherl and right mid he went with Quadrado with the five star skills pretty OP left and right mid there and to finish the team up top he went with Ramos or Bameyang as well as Muriel Ramos there is a cam but item as a center forward so I just used him like this and yeah that is pretty much the whole team like I said earlier on I actually played games with this team played six games I think and lost two or three games so it wasn't the best of overpowered team but I'm going to jump into a game for you guys live see if it can perform any better than it did earlier on and let's see if players like the upgraded Muriel can actually make a difference this is the team I'm coming up against he's got Eto up top charisma nanny in there some pretty decent looking players these are players from the Super League I haven't really seen squads like this around anyways let's see how this goes okay straight to Aubameyang right Aubameyang you're quite pacey use that pace wow what happened there come on Aubameyang finesse it boom oh god that might have been a goal that was so close here we go oh off the post come on Quadrado there we go Quadrado puts it in we're now 1-0 in the lead not that long into the game as well so yeah let's keep this up and wins that Muriel, there we go, Sminish it, Sminish it, Sminish it is not even a word, but it's a pretty close chance right there, now Aubameyang is through, wrong person, see that's the problem with Ramos, his passing isn't the best, now Quadrado's through, he's supporting it, here we go, oh wrong skill mate, what are you doing, free kick accuracy 87, he should be getting close, Come on, Rodriguez. Come on. Oh my days, he hits the post that time. Half time, guys. He's got more possession. I've got more shots and more shots on target. Let's jump into the second half and hopefully get into the lead. Make something happen. We need some magic from you. Oh, what's that? Penalty. Okay. I don't think it was a penalty, but I'll take it. Down the middle with power. Come on. Oh, no. Why do people never move the keepers? Oh my days. Oh my freaking days. Why? 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 Muriel, we need a runner. Ramos, come on. Oh no. Not enough power on that. Ramos, come on. Ramos. Ramos, finish. Oh, just before he took the shot. Muriel, you're through. Oh, for goodness sake. None of my shots are coming off here. That, what's that a card oh it gets a red card okay i mean it did look like a tackle from behind so caused it but he has to pay the price boom you're through finish that bang there we go Aubameyang uses his pace finishes it and it's 2-2 we're back in the game blocked off muriel finish it oh Aubameyang gets in the way of that shot come on guys Boom, Ramos, you're through. Finish it. Ramos, oh my. Wow, he got taken out there. Get there, push it out. Oh, referee. How is that not a free kick? I pushed it past this keeper. Oh, wow. 
Oh, and that's the end of the game, guys. It's finished 2-2. Man of the match was Ramos with an 8.5 rating. Goals came from Cuadrado and Aubameyang. I'm actually really disappointed with that score, guys. We should have won that game. Nevertheless, this is the team once again. Out of all the teams I've used within this series so far, this one is definitely not one of the best. I mean, don't get me wrong. It's a pretty decent team. It's overpowered. If I had to give it a rating out of 10, probably be a, maybe even a 7.5 out of 10 because it's okay, but Ramos in that position in terms of passing he isn't the best at passing and I can easily say individually all these players are overpowered. Quickly want to thank Shay Shippos, the guy who suggested for me to use this team. I mean it was an alright team but it's not a team I would use on a daily basis. Nevertheless if you enjoyed this make sure to drop a like as that would be very much appreciated. Comment your squads down in the comment section. I'll look through them and I'll pick one for my next episode and as for today this is Team Max signing out. Thanks for watching guys and see ya. <laughs> This is the end of the video, hi right? yeah. If you enjoyed, just comment and subscribe what? Wanna see more, don't forget to leave a like Do it! <laughs> this is T-Max signing out